Good morning guys, it's around 11.30 and I just want to start the video, vlog, and show you guys my little outfit. Basically this entire outfit's from Luca and Grey and then I'm wearing my new shoes I just got because I think they're really cute and I want to break them in. So my family and I are just like going to run errands and probably go to Disney Springs so I wanted to include that in this video so I think that's about it for the little intro. Also make sure you're following me on Instagram if you aren't just because that would be awesome. Also my hair is like still a little wet just because I've been putting heat slash cool air on it um, like the past couple times I've washed it and like that's really bad for my hair so I'm trying to let it air dry today just to give it a break. The mothers are here, we've made it to Disney Springs. Bye. We're waiting it out just a little bit because it is pouring down rain right now so we're just waiting for it to flow over. Okay, so it stopped raining a bit, and as you guys can see, it's still raining a little bit. I don't know if you guys can tell, but we made it to the covered area, and I don't know what we're doing next. I really want to see if the ears are here, the mint ears. All right, so our favorite store ever after, the mothers love this store, but it's the cutest little store. They have the mint green collection, and they have the ears here, so I'm so excited. I'm definitely gonna get some, but we're also just gonna look around here and see what they have. All right, so I got the ears. I was gonna wear them, but it's kind of raining, and my head is just getting over a headache, so I decided not to, but they would look really cute with this outfit. Like, they would totally match. So we're at Lululemon and there's a live person like actually doing like yoga and stuff. How fun is that? Yeah. That is so cool. <laughs> doing like different yoga poses. I've never seen anything like that before. All right, so Sherry and I are digging into our Cooks of Dublin. Fish and chips here. I don't eat a lot of the breading because it's really heavy and these fries are the best fries ever. Oh, also guys, I filmed a TikTok with my ears. So go follow me on TikTok if you are not already. Okay, so we ended up coming to this little place. My parents wanted gelato, so um, this is what it's called. But I got sprinkles because I really love their cupcakes. They have a limited menu, so I just got the red velvet one, red velvet cupcake. Yeah, I'll show you guys the gelato when my parents get it. What did you get, ladies? Gelato. Well, I know, but like what flavor? I take vanilla. it out, I got vanilla. Of course. Of course. Vanilla queen. What did you get, Sherry? Maple, or butter pecan and mint chocolate chip. Ooh, oh, we got a mix going on. Here she is in all of her pride and glory. My beautiful cupcake. Kind of top heavy. Top heavy. I'm just kidding, Valerie. I'm so mean. Top heavy. Okay, so it's been a couple days since I last vlogged, but I wanted to try out this new product and it is the Orbe Invisible Defense Universal Protection Spray. And it basically just protects your hair when you put heat on it. I've been drying my hair a lot lately just because of like schedules, like doing things and everything and my shower schedule. So um, the person that does my hair, Abigail, she recommended this to me. So I'm gonna try it out. Like I don't really know what you're supposed to do with it. Shake and mist on damp or dry hair prior to styling for best protection used before hot tools or sun exposure so I'm just gonna shake this also I'm wearing the new top I got it's so cute I'm obsessed with it I'm always nervous that these things are gonna smell like pretty bad and I don't like it but this actually doesn't smell too bad and now I'm just going to dry my hair I'm just gonna put it on warm because I don't want to like damage it too bad, but at least I have the spray on it now. <laughs> It's not completely dry, so that's why I haven't like brushed it out, but it is dry enough and I didn't want to put like even more like heat, warmth, cool on it, so it's just like this. I have a little mini Sephora haul for you guys because I got some new products. So as you guys know, like I love Sierra Furtado and I needed new makeup because I've been using the same makeup for quite a while and I know that's like really dirty and disgusting, but I don't wear makeup like a ton, so I just use 
a lot of the same products for a while just because of that. Like makeup's kind of expensive too, so I just didn't really need a lot of makeup, but I got some new products because I picked out like what Sierra Furtado uses because I like her makeup look, so I just copied her. Um, so I got this brush. This is a contouring brush and it just looks like this. I'm gonna open it on up. I'm gonna open these so you guys can kind of see. So this is what the brush looks like. It is just like, the lady said it was like good for beginners, so I trusted her. Um, I got some makeup wipes, which these are probably like really overly priced, but I didn't have any makeup wipes. As I quickly learned the last time I did my makeup, like I didn't have anything to take it off. So I just used soap and water, which worked fine, but still like the wipes just make it super easy. So I just bit the bullet and got these because it's just convenient. And next I got the NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation in the shade Medium Punjab. It's P-U-N-J-A-B. And there's actually some makeup on it, which is kind of funny. Um, but this is what it looks like. Ooh, fancy. And then it's just a little pump style. This is my shade. It's really cute. It'll just go with my skin tone really well. We just matched it with the neck. I'm happy that I got that because I really needed some like good quality foundation that doesn't make it feel like I'm wearing too much makeup because I don't like the smell of makeup. I'm just really sensitive when it comes to that stuff. And this is pretty like light. It's a pretty light foundation. It's not too heavy, which is good. Next, I got the Laura Mercier translucent powder and I'm hoping this comes with like a little puff thing. It probably doesn't, which is gonna like make me mad, but yeah, I don't think it does. But I'm gonna have to just use one of the brushes I already have. Okay, I'm just gonna leave that sticker on because <laughs> I don't want it to go everywhere. But this is just the powder she used and it's like pretty light and stuff. So it just looks like that. And next, I got the NARS blush in the shade Orgasm. It just looks like this. Hopefully I can get this thing open. Like, hello? This is what the blush looks like. I haven't used blush in a while because I've ran out of it, so it's good that I have this. I got a beauty blender, and guys, I can't believe this thing's like $25. Like, it's a sponge, okay? Like, these people be marking stuff up and making millions off of these things. But I got it because... I don't have a lot to like apply my foundation. So I only had like one brush, so I needed something. I just went with the beauty blender because everyone uses that. And I also got this um, stuff, solid unscented scrub for the beauty blender because like obviously I wanna, you know, wash it every so often to make sure it doesn't like get too dirty. And lastly, I got the Pillow Talk um, Lip Cheat by Charlotte Tilbury. This is just a lip pencil just for some pigmentation. And this thing was so expensive for this like tiny little pencil thing. Like what in the world? So this is the shade. It's like a really like cute nude lip going all old school beauty guru. But yeah, that's the shade. And I like it cause it's just, it gives a nice tint shade and then I can just put like um, some chapstick like over it. So that is what I purchased at Sephora. This is like kind of expensive. I'm not thrilled about it, but I'm happy and I'm definitely gonna like use all the products and stuff for a while probably um, just because I don't wear makeup a whole ton. Okay, so I'm actually gonna try out the makeup. Um, I didn't think I was gonna have enough time and I am kind of in a rush. So I think we're supposed to be like wetting this beauty blender thing. Okay, so she's nice and damp. And then I don't know, do you put this on your hand or the sponge thing? All right, I'm just gonna put it on the sponge. I don't even know how much I'm supposed to use. Okay, four little dabs here. I'm hoping that I do this well and I'm trying to like hurry at the same time. We're trying and thriving. Is that the saying? I don't even know. Oh my goodness. It's very light and I really like it so far. It doesn't have like a huge scent either, which is really nice. I also really like this sponge thing, the beauty blender. This is like honestly my first like experience like using this. I'm like trying to hurry while doing this as well because like I'm running late. It's so light. I love how this feels on my skin. It's so nice. 
it almost feels like a, what I would think a CC cream would feel like. I do need to get the um, concealer, the Shape Tape concealer, but I'll get that like at a later time. But I do have some blemishes that like I could use the concealer with. Yeah, I'm just gonna, there's a little bit left on the thing. So I'm just gonna like wipe that off real quick. Oh my goodness. Okay, hopefully this is like blended okay. I think it is, I'm not sure. Hopefully you find this kind of entertaining. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this thing. I'm just gonna put it back in the little container cause like, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. Now I'm gonna move on to this powder. I'm gonna peel this thing. I'm actually using this brush that I've had for a while cause I don't have anything else to like put the powder on with. Cute. This is the translucent powder. Okay, I'm not doing a time lapse, obviously. This is definitely not a time lapse. I do like the powder, it's kind of cute. It's, you know, just your basic powder. I don't know if I put enough on, but whatever. I'm still like kind of in a hurry. All right, I mean, I think it just did what powder does best. <laughs> just make sure you're nice and like matte, not shiny here. I need to wash this thing. I thought the powder would come with like some sort of like applicator. <laughs> but it didn't. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this back. I already had hula bronzer, so I didn't need to buy any. So I'm just gonna like bronze the face a little bit. How do I get this thing off? Time, okay, I have like, I'm gonna give myself like five more minutes to do this. Okay, so I think she said to like put it up here. Oh my gosh, I'm a hot mess. I guess up here too. And then I think we need to do the blush. Where did that go? It's right here. And again, I guess I need some more makeup brushes cause I only have like a few here. Okay, I'm just gonna use this one again. It won't hurt. Okay, okay. I really like, I do like it. Give me some more color here. I don't know if you can really tell, but I can tell it's like a nice light little pink here. And this, my friends, is the completed makeup look. I really like it. And I'm just going to head out. Okay, so I got one thing when we went out shopping and I just wanted to throw it in this video so you guys can see. Um, so first we have here just this oversized t-shirt with like tigers on it. It's really cute. I got the darker color. I think they have a lighter color version, but I like this. And I can just wear it with like biker shorts and stuff. Um, it's really like loosey goosey, pretty big. I love it. This is a small medium size. So as you guys can see, it's like really oversized. I love that. And then we went to Target and I just got this brush because as you guys know, I did not have a brush for blush and like powder and stuff. So I think I'm just gonna use this for both of those needs that I have. Um, this was like $8 at Target. Um, if I remember, I will link down below this shirt because it's so cute. It's from Urban. Yeah, and I think that is gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.